We are a sorry bunch of losers. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Hey, wh wh what are you doing? This is my show. As I was saying... Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Well, it all started when I wanted to record some clips for my next bot situation video. By the way, this was voted on. At first, I had no luck, since I kept getting games with no bots or bots that would get kicked instantly. So I took a 30 minute break, and oh boy, that made a difference. The first map on my queue list was to Fort, because it's probably the best TF2 map to catch some filthy bots. And it worked. A bit too well. Apparently, Valve transformed to Fort into an MVM map. At first, I was surprised because I thought Valve didn't want to update this game anymore. But it's so nice seeing them give a damn for a change. But this new MVM map was so interesting because I was in the bots team. Hmm, maybe, maybe my job is to be a human spy that gives information to the enemy team. Ahem, <coughs> splendid. I went on and tried to help my actual teammates defeat the bots. And I failed. And then my fake teammates kicked me out of the game. So I told myself, hmm, maybe I should try a different map. Sawmill sounds good. And yeah, apparently Sawmill got transformed into an MVM map. But this time, I was on the human side. What a bugger. And then I thought, hmm, maybe I need a change of scenery. How about changing the game mode? So I went on and searched for the Capture the Point maps. And in less than 10 seconds, it found a game. On hardwood, but it found a game. These were my last words before I entered the server. This will surely be classic TF2 casual fun. This is what I said after spending like 2 minutes on it. Oh man, did Valve just add a new event? And why didn't anyone tell me about it? Wait, why did they all leave? Hmm, where is everyone? And then I found a little friend. So yeah, this is how I ended up playing with one teammate and one enemy on hardwood. Well, at least there are no bots now. You know what, maybe admiring the landscape on hardwood doesn't seem so bad now. Hmm, I always wonder what happened to Valve's approach towards TF2 after Jungle Inferno. Okay, now that the end of the video is here... Time to talk about this problem because, jokes aside, this is kinda bad, I really don't like where this is going. We are already nearing the end of the first quarter of 2024 and we are getting rammed by bots while also having little to no updates. We aren't even getting the localization files updates anymore. So yeah, I hope I'm wrong, but I think we're going back to 2022. Back when we started the hashtag safety of the movement. I also want to know your latest TF2 bots experiences in the comment section down below. Yeah, anyway, bye.